got music. I got my band who blows for and with more. I got daisies in the green pastures. I got my band who blows for and with myself. My name is Marjorie Cartwright Jones and no doubt you will recognize my dulcet tones from my regular broadcasts for the BBC's Kitchen Front Wireless program. But lately I have found myself inching perilously close to the decadent world of show business as I travel the country with my very own home front cabaret show entitled Marjorie Cartwright Jones, that's me, is all front. And jolly good it is too. And here are a few short excerpts for your delectation. So firstly, let us look at how to care for our clothes. Now, ladies, beware the greedy moth between September and spring. The hidden grubs are the enemy and will have a feast on your stored woolens, furs, bristles and silks. Moths hate being disturbed, so you can give the little blighters the shock of their life by airing garments often and thoroughly, or by dicing them in this. Skift moth deterrent for the salvation of your clothes. It has a pleasing, fresh perfume. I even wear it as a powder cologne. It requires far fewer coupons than a bottle of evening in Paris, and it certainly put pay to husband Dickie's Nighttime advances. Moving on, ladies, I can assure you that there is no reason for dried egg to be lumpy. Reconstituting the wholesome egg's dried cousin is as simple as ABC. Allow me to demonstrate. We take one level tablespoon of egg powder and add about two level tablespoons of water. This equals one egg. So firstly, we mix the egg and one tablespoon of water. And leave to stand for about five minutes until the powder has absorbed the moisture. During this time, I usually crochet a bed jacket, reupholster all my dining room furniture, have a quick game of cribbage, you know. <laughs> now we mix the egg to a smooth paste with the remaining water. I find a jolly good beating with a sturdy wooden spoon is ideal for the removal of unwanted lumps. Although sometimes husband Dickie does go away of his own accord. <laughs> now, ladies, do be careful at this stage as over-enthusiasm can, alas, lead to fatally injured millinery. Only last week I discovered bits of my favourite pecan pork pie and feather mount stuck to the bottom of my dried fruit fritters. Now, ladies, I firmly believe it is the duty of each and every one of us to maintain the morale of our menfolk by wearing a full face of slap. 
Not that I would know, of course, as I never wear makeup. Now, all you career girls, do please remember that he'll hate to see you making up or fussing over your face in work hours, but he will notice the moment your nose shines. My favourite powder and scent is by Dewberry. However, it is frightfully expensive. So, if you're rather poor, why not try the Coty range instead? They come in a wide variety of delicious shades, from Caribbean coconut to ginger tom, leather satchel, lemon peril, or indeed the lovely rigor mortis blue. So there you have it. Marjorie Cartwright Jones, that's me, is all front. I do hope to see you all very soon at my Mick to a Mend class. Doodle pip!